Hey YouTube, hey, it's Tony with New Wave Utility Trailers. Today I'm going to show y'all how to make a bracket to hold your spare tire on your trailer. Okay, um, what you do is you get you a piece of uh, six inch piece of square tubing or round tubing, it don't really matter, but I got uh, square tubing and this is six inches from the corner back here. Alright, what you do is you go and um, Put this block underneath your top rail. You weld it underneath the top rail. Make sure it's stout, you know, dang line. Uh, and so, once you get that put up there, you take a piece of 2 by 3 by 3 16 piece of angle iron, and you um, take and put it on top of it like that. And weld this, weld this to the block. The piece of square tubing. Okay, once you get all that done, you get you some um, a bolts that will fit on your lug nuts, which what I did, I cut one of these off to where I could use them. Okay, and then when you get when you get your tire up there, you want to measure uh, on your tire and mark it. Mark it on, on here and then either weld it on there or drill it out. I, you know, I opted to go ahead and um, weld it on there. But anyway, you can do it either way you want to do it. Okay. If you ever hear anybody talking about five on four and a half, here's what they're talking about. They're talking about the lugs on a tire. You don't want to measure, go from here to here. It's, that's not right. That's not the way to do it. You'll go from here to here, or from here to here, or from here to here. That's four and a half. And you got five lugs, four and a half is the center. And it always line up if you do that. So what you do is take and put, the, uh, put this uh, tire up there, or your tire, not mine, uh, and you'll want to uh, mark it. To where the holes is is going to be right here on this and when you get done with that here's what it's going to look like it's going to look like just like that and so uh, that's how you do it it's real simple it's not hard to do uh, you know tell you the truth I've been buying them but um, you know I wanted to go ahead and build this one because this guy that's going to buy this trailer. He wanted everything under the sun on it. He's, he's getting 16-inch uh, tires, um, spring assist for the gate, LED lights, uh, extra uh, spire tire. Yeah, the list goes on and on and on, and he's going to pay for it too. But anyway, that's how you make a spire tire hanger. It's easy. Anybody can do it. Uh, if you have issues with it, you know, be sure to log back in and uh, go watch the video again. You know, everybody's got to learn, and I had to learn. So, um, and it's easy to do, but like I said, just make sure you put it underneath your top rail, and it's not going to work if you put it down here because it's going to drag the ground. But it's plenty enough stout uh, to carry the tire. So, uh, y'all be sure to subscribe. Check back later with another video. We'll talk to y'all. See you.